Bonjour tout le monde, comment ça va? Welcome to French class. Today we are going to learn how to ask information questions with SQ. If you remember, we already learned how to ask yes or no questions. For example, est-ce que tu fais du ski? Do you ski? Non, je ne fais pas de ski. No, I don't ski. Or, est-ce qu'elle est française? Is she French? Oui, elle est française. Yes, she is French. So as you can see here, the yes or no questions only require a yes or no answer. So this is why we call them yes or no questions. But now we want to learn how to ask more specific questions with question words because we want more information in the, in the answers. So, for example, you could use où, which means where. So, just like in English, you would put the, you would place your question word at the beginning of your sentence. Où est-ce que tu habites? Where do you live? J'habite à Paris. So, this is the information that we want. So, we are using où. And then, où is followed by est-ce que, and then the rest of your sentence, which is the subject and the verb. Où est-ce que tu habites? Where do you live? J'habite à Paris. I live in Paris. You can also use quand, which means when. Quand est-ce que tu fais tes devoirs? When do you do your homework? Le soir. In the evening. Or, pourquoi? Why? Pourquoi est-ce que tu n'aimes pas le ski? Why don't you like the ski? Why don't you like skiing? And the answer, parce que. Parce que je n'aime pas l'hiver. Because I don't like winter. So, in the answer, you notice you are going to use parce que, which means because. Comment? How, comment est-ce que tu t'appelles? You already know this type of question. Je m'appelle Nathalie. Or, combien de, and then you would add a noun. Combien de, that means how many. Combien de cours? How many classes? Combien de cours est-ce que tu as ce semestre? How many classes do you take this semester? J'ai quatre cours. I take four classes. You can use que or que apostrophe in front of voyelle, which means what. Here. Yeah. Qu'est-ce que tu aimes faire pendant ton temps libre? What do you like to do during your free time? J'aime écouter de la musique. I like to listen to music. Or qui. That means who or whom. Second example, qui est-ce que tu admires? J'admire ma mère. Whom do you admire? I admire my mother. Or the first example, qui est ton acteur préféré? Who is your favorite actor? C'est Brad Pitt. It's Brad Pitt. And here, you don't use est-ce que because the verb is directly uh, placed uh, after the question word. So you want to remember here that just as in English when you use those question words to ask specific questions, you are going to do the same in French. You are going to use all those question words to ask more specific questions. So let's practice. In this activity, you need to find the correct question word that is related here to this information in the answer. So let's look at the answer here. J'aime la plage. Uh, J'aime aller à la plage, sorry. J'aime aller à la plage le weekend. I like to go to the beach on weekends. So what do you think would be here the question word for when do you like to go to the beach? Yes, it's going to be quand. Quand est-ce que tu aimes aller à la plage? When do you like to go to the beach? J'aime aller à la plage le week-end. 
C'est qu'un exemple. Je préfère étudier à la bibliothèque. I prefer to study at the library. Here we're looking for a place, right? So what would be the question word for the question, where do you prefer to study? Yes, it's going to be où. Où est-ce que tu préfères étudier? J'ai un chien. I have one dog. I have a dog. How many dogs do you have? Oui, combien? Combien de chiens est-ce que tu as? In this one, je fais du yoga. I practice yoga. I do yoga. What would be the question word here that, that would translate? What do you do on Friday after your class? Yes, it would be that que apostrophe because of the E here. Qu'est-ce que tu fais? Le vendredi, après les cours. Here, je préfère mon père. I prefer my father. How would you translate here? Whom do you prefer in your family? Yes, you are going to use qui. Qui est-ce que tu préfères dans ta famille? Here, parce que c'est une bonne université. Because it's a good university. What would be the question word? Why do you study at UF? Pourquoi? Pourquoi est-ce que tu étudies à UF? And then the last one, you already know this type of sentence. Hein? Elle s'appelle Valérie and you want to say comment. Comment est-ce qu'elle s'appelle ta meilleure amie? Elle s'appelle Valérie. Voilà, merci beaucoup. I hope it helped. Euh, merci, au revoir et I'll see you in the next video. À bientôt.